In the last two years, basically since I moved back in May of 2020, I have done a lot more walking. I live close to a set of trails and greenways, and large parts of my city are very pedestrian friendly. So on weekends, whether it's a quick 20 minute loop around the block or a four hour journey to the city center and back, I make it a point to get out for a walk. Most of the time I'm listening to music or podcasts. I usually don't have a destination in mind. I'm just trying to move my body and sometimes explore new neighborhoods. And it feels like something I can accomplish. If I do nothing else with my day, at least I got out for a walk. I have a few favorite routes, including one which takes me down through the park to the lake, which I've now seen in all four seasons. In the winter, when it's frozen over and people clear its surface to skate and play ice hockey. In the spring, when warmth and life returns. In summer, when families come to picnic. And in the fall, when the leaves change and fog rolls in and rain dances on the surface of the water. I find myself taking out my headphones to just stand and stare. One thing I've essentially not done in the last two years is meditate. I find stillness is an excellent way of releasing tension in my body and letting go of the anxieties that make me feel simultaneously agitated and stuck. I have a meditation bench that my Nana made for me. I have meditation as a goal in my mood tracker, and yet I do not meditate. Except maybe I do, here in the park, when I sit at a picnic table or bench, when I stand at the water's edge and stare. Something in me says, stop, look, listen, and I'm present. When I used to meditate sitting or kneeling or lying still, it would take minutes, probably at least five minutes to actually relax. With each exhale, I would imagine myself sinking and try to release the tension I was holding in any part of my body. This practice allowed me to let go of my thoughts and be aware of my body. And then gradually, I would sort of cease to be aware of anything of my body or thoughts or time, I would just be until that awareness returned. I don't set out to meditate when I'm walking. If I did, honestly, I would leave my phone at home. But sometimes I find myself in this kind of meditative state and it feels like I stop because I don't want to be anywhere else. There's no desire to reach a destination or to distract myself but simply to be where I am. <laughs>